in control of Cena right back to the arm. Great strategy. Weaken the poor, powerful Cena by taking away one of his arms. Brian sticking to his wheelhouse, not taking any unnecessary risks here against John Cena. Oh, just looking to control and neutralize the bigger man. Cena, though, back to his feet. Brian continues to work on the arm, but now Cena. Test of strength, and you don't want to get into a power battle with John. Absolutely not. Cover here. And a kick out. And again, Cena powering Danielson down. Oh, look at this incredible core strength by Danielson. Cena cannot believe that he can't get Danielson's shoulders on the mat. Going to try it again, and Danielson able to Up reverse. Oh. And sends nice. Cena flying. Incredible sequence. Oh, man. Cena just took Danielson's head off. As we say that sometimes there's no replacement for brute force. Inflicting some serious pain here. Looking to take out the neck with that one. Oh, I think this man be going for the stretch here. This one's over, guys. Caught with the elbow. Right on the jaw. Right on his neck and back. His drop kick finds the mark. That slam put him in a bet. Look out, he breaks free. Great job by him there, but he's still in a tough spot, Cole. You can almost see the wind leave his body after that. Dropped him with a big shoulder tackle. Gets him with the fist. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. He lands the belly to belly. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. And he lands the slam. That's how you make an impact. It's all academic from here. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. So painful. The human body can only absorb so much of that. German suplex! Woo! And a wicked elbow shot right there. Nice move. John Cena got him there. John Cena's modified powerbomb has defeated some heavy hitters as of late. And a small guy like Brian Danielson has to have a huge target on his back. Yeah, it's pretty amazing, Saxton. He picks up his opponent as if he's doing a belly-to-back suplex, then twists him around in midair and plants them like somebody would do with a rock bottom. If he keeps calling out Brock Lesnar, John Cena may just be a speed bump on Brock's road to WrestleMania. Brock won the Royal Rumble, so he'll be in the main event that night, and I cannot wait. I heard Cena wants to do a rap battle at WrestleMania. As for this Brian Danielson goose, maybe he'll watch it on pay-per-view, though I doubt he even owns a TV. This Brian Danielson guy looks a little nerdy, but apparently he's got a pretty impressive pedigree. Where'd he come from? Cole, Brian Danielson began his training with a former WWE champion, Monday Night Raw's own Shawn Michaels. Before his big comeback, HBK actually started a wrestling school, and we're seeing one of its graduates. John Cena is the very prototype of a WWE superstar. He's got the physique and athleticism of a future WWE champion. I completely agree, Byron. We've already seen him beat some main event talent like Chris Jericho and Rikishi in singles action. I can't tell what's more outrageous. Cena's recent raps are those ugly yellow pants. You're just jealous, Saxon. Cena's got dope style and mad rhymes. Hippity hoppity hoppity. John Cena's stock has really risen lately, so it's no surprise that he's now challenging Royal Rumble winner Brock Lesnar. Just seven months ago, he made quite an impact on his debut. When Vince McMahon implored the locker room to... Will it be? I think so! John Cena's been on a roll lately. Ever since he started spitting rhymes back in October, he started to rile up all of the SmackDown locker room. Yeah, Cena has gained attention. If you're Brian Danielson, what do you do at this point as he whips yeah! Cena across the ring? Oh, Cena gets up a boot just in time. And now John Cena looking to take over. Looking up. Put oh. Brian Danielson where he wants him. And here's the cover. And he got him. Cena with the wins over Brian Danielson. Here is your winner. John Valiant effort Cena. by Danielson, but Cena was just too much tonight. A hard-fought victory tonight for Cena. Got to be impressed with Cena tonight. Can we point out how different John Cena's opponents will be this month? Tonight he takes on a puny little indie wrestler that's probably worse than Saxton in the ring that nobody knows. On Thursday he takes on the next big...
We're here on the inaugural episode of NXT, the World Heavyweight Champion Chris Jericho taking on the Miz rookie, Daniel Bryan. I've been looking forward to this main event. WrestleMania is on the horizon, but tonight is a, a WrestleMania of sorts for all the NXT rookies. Well, Daniel Bryan was excited earlier in the night to be out on the biggest stage of his life, but that was before he knew he was going to face the World Heavyweight Champion. He's going to have to learn to take his advice if he wants to survive here. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Go oh, elbow. It's just a matter of time now. I've got to say, I'm surprised to see Brian actually testing the champion here a bit. It must be the inspiration from The Miz that's propelling this offense. A oh, rolling elbow. You can say whatever you want to say about The Miz. He's a loud mouth, but he's the unified tag team champion. He's the United States champion. And the fact of the matter is this guy, Daniel Bryan, has to show some respect for the WWE Pro. Yeah, respect is due to The Miz. I mean, just because Miz comes out here in the WWE Universe, disrespects him for absolutely no reason. Doesn't give Bryan the permission to do the same thing. We got a cover. And Jericho pops the shoulder up. Nope. To beat the Ayatollah. There's no way that Jericho's going to lose to this guy. Yeah, but the way this match is going, it's a real possibility. Uh -oh. Jericho, though, needs a breather, and he rolls out of the ring to try to do that. Wise maneuver from a wily veteran. Uh, I'm not sure if Jericho's going to get much rest time. What's this oh, guy Brian? doing? Daniel Bryan! Oh. Suicide dive right off the announce desk. Like Brian might have bounced off the announce desk himself. I don't think Miz liked the fact that Brian threw his body in harm's way, and I, I can't say I blame him. What's this guy thinking? Observing the relationship between the Miz and Daniel Bryan, I don't think there's any chance hey, Daniel Bryan's Bryan's going right to get the embarrassment. He's been showing us why so he's a what if world Daniel Bryan renowned for his ground and pound attack. Any respect? World what if? He's going to get what the hell beat about it. What's what are you talking about? He's been on the independent scene. It's the first time he's ever been on television. This guy's a goof. We may have a count out here, guys. It certainly looks that way, Michael. Eight. Guys, you're getting ahead of yourself. Look oh, out. Be some sort of miracle. Oh, boy. See, I told you. Oh, boy. This one's over now. Roll him into the walls of Jericho. Tap him out, Chris. Ryan's trying to fight it. Rolls through. What a counter by the technician there. Oh, my oh, God. God. Here, Hook is in. Jericho's in trouble. Jericho tried it. Is he going to tap? Is he going to tap? He may have no choice. He may, he made it to the bottom rope. You have got to be impressed, Michael, from what we're seeing from Daniel Bryan. Did Daniel, he win yet, Byron? Daniel Bryan thinks he... Oh, breaker! You can't allow a veteran like Jericho any time to recover. You're right, Corey. That was a rookie move. And now he's going to pay for it, Byron. That may, very well may be the case, Michael. This loser's going to lose again. Uh, Lion Tamer. Can Brian hold on? Tap out, nerd. You got your wish, Cole. Daniel Bryan fought valiantly, but just couldn't the hang with a champ. Yeah, this Chris time, Jericho. experience was just too much for Daniel Bryan. And listen, Miz has got to be so disappointed, and I don't blame him luck of the draw. Miz got this loser. 
to be his protege. And now, Miz a little bit of tough whoa, love here. Whoa, tough love? Give me a break. Tough love. This is ridiculous. Miz is obviously frustrated with his star pupil. So that's okay. Now you can beat him up. Yeah, start winning some matches. Then he won't get beat up anymore. This is ridiculous. What this is good thing. Huh? I'm a champion. Miz has lost his right. mind. Lying on his back, looking at the lights again. The Miz and Daniel Bryan have been polar opposites throughout their careers, making for a fierce rivalry. But the weird part is that the indie darling Daniel Bryan began in WWE as a protege of reality star The Miz on NXT. Miz and Daniel Bryan were teammates in name only. You know, some NXT pairings, like myself and Dolph Ziggler, had excellent pro-rookie relationships. Miz and Bryan, however, hated each other from the very start. You two brought up that acrimonious relationship between the Miz and Daniel Bryan. Miz abused Bryan, and Bryan fought back, taking Miz's spot in the SummerSlam main event, and then his United States Championship just a month later. After laying dormant for a few years, the Miz and Daniel Bryan's hatred resurfaced in the infamous Talking Smack segment. After Daniel Bryan returned to action and pulled strings to get the Miz moved to SmackDown Live, you know this rivalry is far from over, even after eight years. Work is being put in by Daniel Bryan. Now we have Daniel Bryan on the attack. Why would anyone, please tell me, why would anyone root for Daniel Bryan? He's an indie internet nerd. He doesn't eat meat, he doesn't own a TV, and he has absolutely no personality, and he is a dog named Asparagus. Oh my gosh, who cares what Daniel Bryan eats or watches or what his dog's name is? He's great in the ring, and for the record, he showed a lot of personality when he called you out after his NXT elimination. Please. Back now inside the ring. He's going for it all. Look at this! Daniel Bryan using his speed right there. Daniel Bryan took the Miz's spot at SummerSlam last month, and if he keeps this up, he'll take the U.S. title too. Byron. The Miz is the future of the... He's got him covered. Digging deep for a kick out. Not yet. Even though Daniel Bryan did not have the best track record oh. as an NXT rookie, I think a win tonight would make Daniel Bryan worthy of being a 
WWE NXT Pro. Don't you think? If Daniel Bryan ever becomes an NXT Pro, then there's a 1% chance I'll continue doing that show. What kind of weirdo would ever take advice from Daniel Bryan? That would be like a, a young announcer learning from you, Byron. Daniel Bryan may only be eight months into his WWE career, but this is a decade-long journey for Bryan that could lead to his first taste of WWE gold here at Night of Champions. It was March of 2000 when Daniel Bryan made his debut on the independent scene under the wing of Shawn Michaels, and we might see Bryan make his first drive towards Daniel. Oh, boy, he is rolling. The Miz is looking at this. So damaging. Is it enough to end this match? That's it. The Miz just ended this. Brian is not playing right now. Oh, the reversal by The Miz. One move after the other. It's devastating. why anyone's surprised that The Miz and Daniel Bryan's relationship has come to this. The Miz can never keep an ally on his side. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Every person the awesome one has won the tag titles with has ended up hating The Miz. Remember the night after Extreme Rules when the Big Show's KO punch ended so Miz? If, if, if the Miz comes up short here tonight against Daniel Bryan. Well, it hasn't happened yet, has it, Byron? Uh, it could be on the verge of occurring. Daniel Bryan from the top rope. Miz is in trouble. Yeah, but look at the Miz fight back. What a warrior. Oh, 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 man. Oh. Great wherewithal from the Miz. Daniel Bryan hung out to dry. Oh, oh no! no! Just like that, the Miz has turned the tides in this matchup. This is what I'm talking about. Look at this. Yes! Yes! The Miz wins! The Miz wins! And here's another peek at the moves he saw in that match. Here is your winner, and still, the United States Champion, the Daniel Bryan gave it his all, but The Miz remains. Look at The Miz. He's worked hard, he's charismatic, he's smart. He's Mr. Money in the Bank. And he's the United States Champion. Well, Michael, he may not be one of those things if he lands in Daniel Bryan's label lock. Bryan faced Miz in a submission match on Raw, and he made Miz tap faster than a heavy metal drummer. If that happens tonight, we'll have a new United States Champion. Miz was saving himself. You have to think that's it. Daniel Bryan with a great offensive show. Now we have Daniel Bryan on the attack. Look out. I'll be shocked if that's not it. Warm up the buses. This one's over. Look at this. because a lot more people relate to Daniel Bryan than they do The Miz. Relate to Daniel Bryan? How can he relate to a guy who doesn't own a TV or eat meat? I can't believe that Daniel Bryan even has a championship match here tonight. He basically quit NXT, becoming the first person eliminated. He is nothing more than a loser, like you, Saxton. Well, I agree with the end there, bro, but the elimination may have been a blessing in disguise. While the rest of the NXT performers formed the Nexus, 
Daniel Bryan stood against their injustices in the main event of SummerSlam. We discussed Daniel Bryan's last place finish on NXT. He was on that show. Boy, am I glad he didn't win. Can you imagine? He goes for the cover. Digging deep for a kick out. How in the world? Headbutt. Daniel Bryan looking to attack from high. I believe Daniel Bryan has a strong chance of winning tonight, man. The guy was trained by Shawn Michaels, who must have taught Bryan a thing or two about high-pressure matches. What has happened to you, Corey? You've turned into another Saxton. Yeah, and Daniel Bryan was also trained by The Miz. Quite frankly, Bryan should have listened to The Miz more, and maybe he would have won it. And his dropkick connects. He's really looking to prove a point here. You know what? I take back what I said about Daniel Bryan potentially winning NXT. Bryan never could have won NXT. He started with a 10-match losing streak. He probably only quit because he would have been eliminated soon. Anyway, uh, Michael, all it takes is one win to change your fortune. And Daniel Bryan looks likely to get that win tonight. Well, exactly. what happens if, if, they, if the Miz comes up short here tonight against Daniel Bryan? Well, it hasn't happened yet, has it, Byron? Uh, it could be on the verge of occurring. Daniel Bryan from the top rope. Miz is in trouble. Yeah, but look at the Miz fight back. What a warrior. Oh, oh, man. No. Great wherewithal from the Miz. Daniel Bryan hung out to dry. Boom. Oh, no! Just like that, the Miz has turned the tides in this matchup. This is what I'm talking about. He's going for the pin. Daniel Bryan kicks out easily. Well, unfortunately, yes movements don't die that easily. Big opening for Daniel. <laughs> La Bell Lock, the La Bell Lock is in. This is all but over. And he breaks free just when you thought he was out of this one. The Miz is on. He breaks free. But the damage might have already been done, Michael. That's got to hurt. The Miz's grasp on the United States Championship is slowly slipping away. No, Miz can't lose here tonight. Not like this. Look at this. The Miz with the offense. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. And Daniel Bryan kicks out. He isn't going to go away that easy. The Miz is looking at this. From what we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. Never underestimate the Miz's awesomeness. Yeah, that had to break a bone. Daniel Bryan, this is going to be big. Nice. That's it. It's over. It's over. The Miz getting outclassed here tonight, guys. All that's left now is for Daniel Bryan to finish this. What an insane move by Daniel Bryan. The Miz getting outclassed here tonight, guys. <laughs> oh, bell lock, the little bell lock is in. That should do it. Good job getting to the ropes there. Yeah, that could have been bad. Daniel Bryan with a great offensive show. Work is being put in by Daniel Bryan. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Incoming. Ah. 
How'd he do that? I don't know, Michael, but good thing. I don't think he could have taken much more of that. The Miz is looking at this. Skull crushing finale. That's how you put an exclamation point on a match. The champion into the cover. One, two, three. Yes, yes, The Miz wins. The Miz wins. Let's look back on the action from the last match. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Here is your again. winner, Epic. and still the United States Champion, The Miz! Look at the Miz. He's worked hard. He's charismatic. He's smart. He's Mr. Money in the Bank. And he's the United States Champion. Well, Michael, he may not be one of those things if he lands in Daniel Bryan's LaBelle lock. Bryan faced Miz in a submission match on Raw, and he made Miz tap faster than a heavy metal drummer. If that happens tonight, we'll have a new United States Champion. Miz was saving himself. Daniel Bryan really got the Miz's bad side when he took the A-lister SummerSlam spot, and then the Miz's United States title one month later. Well, the rivalry exploded a half-decade later when The Miz ranted against SmackDown Live general manager Daniel Bryan on Talking Smack. After Bryan returned to competition, he pulled strings to get The Miz back on SmackDown, so this rivalry is back in a big way. Looks like he's pinpointing the back. Now that's the type of move that sends a message to an opponent. Between his championship, his briefcase, and his media obligations, Miz is slipping just a little here. He'll bounce back. Close fist. You have to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Nicely done. I just cannot believe the disrespect The Miz had to endure at the hands of Daniel Bryan. All he wanted to do on NXT was help Bryan, and that big nerd never listened. Oh, whoa, disrespect? Disrespect that The Miz slapped Daniel Bryan in the face on the very first episode of NXT. If I were ever to be on NXT, I'd never take that kind of abuse from my pro. You on NXT? <laughs> He's talking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. You guys brought up Miz and Brian's relationship on NXT. Obviously, Brian can't learn any new moves from the Miz, but ironically, Brian's hatred of shoulders on the back. There's not a person in this arena who thought that that was it for him. He can withstand a lot more punishment, I can promise you that. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Look out! Daniel Bryan took the Miz's spot at SummerSlam last month, and if he keeps this up, he'll take the U.S. title, too. Byron, the Miz is the future of the WWE. He has to win tonight. Daniel Bryan always thought he was better than the Miz, but just look at what he's done since dumping Daniel Bryan. He's defending the United States Championship on pay-per-view, formed a tag team with Chris Jericho, and defeated seven men.
to win Money in the Bank. Hey, and that's impressive. But if Daniel Bryan was given those same kind of opportunities, he could well, what happens if, if, if the Miz comes up short here tonight against Daniel Bryan? Well, it hasn't happened yet, has it, Byron? Uh, it could be on the verge of occurring. Daniel Bryan from the top rope. Miz is in trouble. Yeah, but look at the Miz fight back. What a warrior. Oh, 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 man. Oh. Great wherewithal from the Miz. Daniel Bryan hung out to dry. Boom! Oh, no! Just like that, the Miz has turned the tides in this matchup. This is what I'm talking about. Byron, you really ticked me off with that shoulders are down. The Miz Daniel being Bryan kicks out easily. Like money and the, the match continues. He earned those. And it's internet darlings like Daniel Bryan, who everyone expects to get all the can to jam is Daniel Bryan to the gate. Daniel Bryan dangerous for like Bell Lock. Like no one in the gate more than that. Bryan has some if not, he do that. The man, though, like old Bell Lock, you would think. I don't think he could have taken out there again. Knocked right off his feet. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. Submission specialist Daniel Bryan. Oh, 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 oh. The bell, bell lock is in. The Miz getting outclassed here tonight, guys. But now, can Bryan make the most of this? He did it. Daniel Bryan is U.S. champion. No, no, it can't be. There's good, there's great, and then there's downright unbelievable WWE action. Ladies and gentlemen, you just got a taste of the unbelievable kind. Here is your winner and the new United States Champion, Daniel Bryan. That was a fluke. The miss slipped and Daniel Bryan somehow took advantage. A long road for Daniel Bryan leads to the United States title. There's few things more humiliating than tapping out to your opponent. And I'll tell you, the roof nearly blew off this place in Rosemont, and the bell finally rang to end this one.